Uh, hi, this is your friend and your brother, Doc Mountain. I welcome you to today's lesson. In our lesson, we are going to look at uh, the conic sections. So what then is the conic section? Well, conic sections are simply intersections of a plane and a cone. So as you can see, we have two cones. There is a cone on top. The other one is at the bottom. So that's a double cone. And then the blue sheet is actually the plane that I just made, made mention of. So now, what is it that we are likely to, to have when we bring a plane in contact with a cone? So now, those are the things that we're going to look at. So by the end of this day, you should be able to, to identify the conic sections. You should be able to describe the conic sections that you're likely to have when you bring a plane in contact with, with a cone. So now, let's take a look. If we happen to incline this uh, plane at an angle, in line with a cone, you're going to have the first conic section and that's called the parabola. So I hope you're able to see that green structure that actually denotes or demar demarcates the intersection of a plane with a cone. And that's a parabola. So the parabola is one of the conic sections. What, what, what kind of a conic section would we have if we were to further incline this plane at a different angle, 80 degrees? There we go. Okay, so now we have a new conic section, which is actually an ellipse. So an ellipse is another conic section. It's actually oval. An ellipse is oval. It's more like a second, but it's not. That's an oval, an oval shape. But you need to know that not all oval shapes are ellipses. However, an ellipse is an oval shape. Let's see if we further incline this uh, plane at a different angle. Okay, so now what is it that you're seeing, seeing there? What we have is actually... A circle that's a circle so we have another conic section which is a circle so far so good I've mentioned of three conic sections what are those are you able to remember those that I just mentioned of I will drive you back I will actually twist this we have an ellipse it's one of the conic sections then we have a parabola as another conic section and then when we further incline this uh, plane at this angle where we happen to to align it with the edges of the cones then we're going to have those two double shapes what do you call those that's a hyperbola a, a hyperbola has two shapes, one on top, the other one at the bottom. Those that are identical. Hope you're able to see that. 